up to just ran into the commissioner there and had a little conversation with him. So um, it's been a good week of practice, um, really solid week. I, I really feel good about our team right now and um, the place we're in. I think the guys really had a lot of bounce in their step and a good solid week and, and hopefully they'll carry over to Saturday. We're going to need to play our best here this week. As we've seen Lynn get better on kickoff returns throughout the year, how big a weapon can that be against a defense as good as Georgia's? For yeah, well, all the all those yards are important. You know, any way you know you can get a possession is going to be important and get yards. Uh, we're going to have to play solid in all of our special teams. And uh, kickoff return is going to be big. It's going to be tough because they they have an excellent kicker, puts good hang on it. You're not going to get a ton of opportunities, and when you do, they've got some some dudes running down there. So. Uh, kickoff return is going to be a real challenge. What do you see from Georgia's rush defense? What what makes them so effective? They're 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 guys that have been around and they're they're big and stout, but they're playing really good fundamentally. Good good, uh, you know their front seven is as good as anybody in the country, and uh, they're they're really playing with good technique. They mix it up and they're big strong guys. With the new early signing period next month, how much does that change kind of your schedule that you didn't have to deal with before, and how much more work is it? It, it does change it quite a bit. We've actually been, uh, as you know, we spent a lot of time with recruiting, but we've had to spend a lot of time with recruiting um, organization this early with planning our schedule, where we're going, and, and so it's going to be a busy weeks. The nice thing this year, just the way the calendar fell, is we actually get three weeks to go recruit where I believe last year was two, maybe two in a day or two. But um, so it's nice to have the three weeks because you're going to need to get in front of everybody with the early signing period. So um, it does change it here this, this with, year. With the players already committed, do you expect kind of across the country for a lot of those guys to sign during that early signing yes. period? Yes. Do you think that the coaches being fired mid-season, do you think that's going to alter that at all? I mean, is that something you guys have talked about? Alter it, it, it in Maybe which slow way? some guys down to say, wait, let's see who gets here or who goes there or how that works. Yeah, it could. It could. Um, I'm not sure. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, it, it, it could. I'm not, not exactly sure. You know, this is our first go-around with that. Um, so a lot of it is yet to be seen. And uh, I think... You know, by the twentieth, I would think most hires would be finalized, but uh, but I don't know. You know never know. You said on uh, Monday that you were pleased with the report that you got on Kendall. Do you expect him to be full though? Yes, I do. Everybody's good.